there were some pretty severe problems with the hospital buildings, both ours and Cook. You couldn't do anything in the state of Texas without a certificate of need. And you can't expand or change your hospital in any way without having a certificate of need acceptance. They were below 50% as were we. Cook couldn't get one to fix their problems and we couldn't get one to fix ours. We knew from that that we would have to combine the two. It gave both hospitals a chance to survive. So we dealt with that mainly for the first few years I was on the board. Um, and then we started having clandestine meetings trying to figure out what we'd have to do to make this thing work. It became apparent that we were going to have to give our assets over to Cook. And so it was all, it all, it all happened right then in 1983. At the same time, we had to start building projects and everything else. We were forced into it, but it turned out to be the, the greatest possible thing could have happened. And even the name Cook Children's reflects both hospitals. It was my biggest triumph ever in things that I'd been part of. This, this is something they said we couldn't do. It could never happen. And it, it happened, and we've done it. To see it evolve into a huge, wonderful hospital like it has. Every time I drive by it, I feel a feeling down deep. It's just hard to explain. I'm so proud of it.